Here it is. Wow. There's Elizabeth in 3D. There she is. Would you say looking like a sim? Uh, yeah, she <laughs> looks like a sim. You could put that on a video game character. Yeah, How we cool. Can, we, can, uh, we can zoom right in. <gasps> oh, gosh. Things. Thank you for doing that. Yeah, yes, please, please zoom in as we close want, as you can. My eyelashes look great. We, this, so this shows us all the things uh, that you don't want to see, but we want to see is so that we can wow. help you to achieve yeah, skincare goals. And this is a—I mean, this is a big piece of technology it that really was is. brought here at Superior Aesthetics, and it really does. As you were explaining to me, I put the headband on, I put the Superman cape on for the pictures, but it gives you that um, kind of topical look, but it also goes deeper than that. It does. Um, so we do vein treatment here, also, um, so we can go into your skin assessment, and you can wow. see your you know, the heavy areas of blood flow there. So not only do you, if we treat the surface, you can also go below the surface and treat. So maybe you might treat those veins surfacely, but we can even go deeper and see that we need to go deeper. Um, you know, for people who are maybe wanting to, you know, do more plastic side of that, it gives you measurements, it gives you things. We can do simulations of maybe what you would look like with filler. Um, so it's really useful for, um, like Amanda with injections and things like that. So maybe you want to know what you look like with a little bit, you know. Can, can you lip. can you give me a fuller wow. lip real quick, or does that take too long? It would take me. It would take me a little bit to okay. to do that to to inject okay. that in in there. Well, maybe um, by the end of the show. But maybe, yeah. So if Put you, you want to, well, yeah. Um, so and then. And obviously, in. I have a lot of makeup on because I have studio yes, makeup. So that's, we encourage people when they come in to not wear makeup uh, mm -hmm. because, you know, obviously it's it's it blocks it's, everything. It changes yeah. your pores, it changes sure. your pores, it changes yeah. the structure of your face in some element. Is there anything that you see that sticks out right away? Well, we're we're going to go to your we're going to go to your skin analysis okay. page. So this is okay. this is what we do. Um, we come into here and it tells us um, a report. So it gives you you know, what your wrinkles are for it. So this goes by your age, right? So we go by, we punch in your birthday. And so for your age group, you are above average. You are on the fifth percentile. I'm wrinkly. Percentile. I'm a little bit wrinkly. But you're above average for your age group. Okay. Yeah. So, so, this, so this tells you in your areas, this is, this is telling you what your areas are. And as far as your wrinkles, this goes for your pores. Um, and again, above average. Um, is this a bad thing to be above average? No, no, no it's, it's what you want. Oh, okay, oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, this I is see. what you want. I was so gonna say, I'm wrinkly because I laugh a lot. That's what I always yeah. say. No. <laughs> so for your age group, you're above I'm average. I'm doing okay. You're doing, okay. You're doing great. Yeah. Okay. Um, so your evenness, your oiliness, it talks about your red areas. Um, then we go to the other side. This is where you fall be uh, below the, uh, a uh, little yeah. bit below average. Those are called laugh not, lines. There right? you go, it's there you go. Much. <laughs> it's not much. Um, and you know, again, pores looking great. Um, these are your brows, so this is your sun damage, you know, so we can see those bad areas. Um, so when we have our October rejuvenation yeah. package, those are the areas that you want to treat. Okay. Um, your evenness, your oiliness on the other side of your face, your red areas. And so it, we continue to go down, just keeps breaking other it down, keeps yeah. breaking it down. Um, and then at the end, it gives you, what, what we do is we print this off for anybody who would like this to take home and, you know, maybe look at it a little bit more. And it kind of explains a little bit of, you know, we're looking at Want to be on the top ten? Right? We want to be on the up and up. There was a lot of blue on there, and uh, and so it kind of explains, you know. Okay. Obviously. <laughs> so we don't want to be down here. If I was coming in wondering what I should get, if if there was a procedure, what would you recommend based on my results? Anything in particular mm -hmm. that I personally would recommend? Yeah, for me to to get to to you know, um, should I get a. Uh, I think I chemical th peel or I think it's I think it's good to start with all of that stuff. Yeah. I think starting with chemical peels, kind of getting your skin back to home base, and then going in and getting you know some, some injections, yeah. maybe a little Botox and PR an the PRF micro needling is fantastic. Okay. Um, yeah, it smooths out some of that if you don't want the Botox, you know. Yeah. So. Well, this is kind of a game changer, not in just looking at someone's skin, but then being able to explain it to the patient. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. And yeah. it goes in your it goes in your chart, and we do this for every patient that comes in. So. Very cool. Yeah. Very cool. All right, wow. we have to take another break. Thanks for doing that. I do laugh a lot. What I'm seeing is that I you're in the, the top. <laughs> you're in the top. <laughs> Let's go. Living life. Living life. <laughs> All right, we're, we'll take a break and we'll come right back.